Luke stopped mid-sentence in the door of the cooler, his eyes going from confused to fury in the span of a heartbeat. Harper struggled to free herself from Link's grip, but he only pushed her behind him. Garrison, Link said, his tone cooler than the chilled air. Well, you don't waste any time, do you? Harper saw Luke's jaw twitch when she peeked around Link's back. I don't know what you're talking about, Link said evenly. I wasn't talking to you. Harper felt the sick change to fury in her gut. She made a move to sidestep Link, but he was already halfway across the cooler. Luke met him in the middle, and Harper shrieked when the first blow landed. George Ray, Mr. Scotts, Sheila, and Peggy Ann stood in the doorway, mouths agape. Call Ty! Harper yelled, grabbing at a thrashing arm in a jacket. Stop it! Both of you! She wedged herself between them, Luke at her front and Link at her back. You ever touch her again, and I'll... Harper slapped her hands against Luke's chest. Shut up! Just shut up! She shoved him back with all her strength. You have no say anymore in who does and doesn't touch me. I don't belong to you anymore. Her voice broke, and she hated herself for it. Luke gripped her wrists and brought his gaze to her face. Tears threatened to spill onto her cheeks, and time stopped. His lip was cut, his eyes wild. He hadn't shaved in days. She could see the hurt, the anger. But he wasn't hers to love or heal. He was the man who discarded her. She wrenched her hands free. Harp! It was hurt now in his tone. No, she whispered, staring at his chest. He made a move toward her and she stepped back, holding up her hands. She said no, Link said, pulling her back. Stay the fuck out of this, Reed. Luke shoved Link and they tangled again, crashing into a rack of six-packs. Two tumbled to the floor and shattered as Harper jumped out of the way. Link shoved Luke up against the rack. Why do you have to be such an asshole? Luke's fist caught him on the jaw and Harper yelped. Someone help! A crowd had gathered in front of the cooler. Every door was wide open so the spectators could get a better look. Damn, that was the logger they just broke. Someone sighed as another six-pack fell to its frothy death. Harper flinched as Link's fist plowed into Luke's middle. They were going to pound each other into oblivion. Harper grabbed Link's arm as he pulled it back to hit Luke again. Her body felt weightless as she was carried through the air by the momentum of Link's blow. Luke threw another punch, and Harper felt the breeze of it brush her face. He was too angry. She wasn't going to be able to stop him. An arm nipped her around the waist, dragging her out of the fray. Ty, in uniform, deposited her in the doorway of the cooler. Ty, make them stop. On it. Stay here. Ty threw himself into the brawl with the practiced form of law enforcement. In seconds, he was able to disengage Link. It took a little longer with Luke, who took an angry swing at his brother-in-law. Ty shrugged it off and punched Luke square in the jaw, knocking him back a step. Don't make me tase the shit out of you. I'll do it and probably enjoy it, 